I, you know, I went to uh, an independent school where all of my uh, peers, all of my friends, uh, went through academic routes. I was one of the only individuals that didn't. But again, as I looked back on my progression after the first few years, you know, I was looking at individuals who had gone to university who perhaps hadn't progressed to the level I was at. So I felt like I'd succeeded. I'd succeeded early on. Of course, everyone catches up. If you, if there's something you want to do in life, then you can do it. Um, you'll get there if you're passionate and you can do it. Whether it's you need qualifications or not, I I don't have the qualifications. Thank you. But I had the passion to do what I do and have progressed on that. Um, I came straight from school, um, so I was actually in the luxury retail wear uh, store manager at 17, regional uh, 20. Um, and then I moved to London at 21, moved to Nike two years ago. Um, I just think it's hard graft, put your head down. Education didn't prepare me, I mean academic, academically what I achieved is in no way, no way prepares you for the real world, the streets of real life. I think advertising is one of those things where actually, um, you know, it should be a very democratic industry because you're only as good as the ideas you have and actually those don't always come from the people who have the best grades. Uh, or are necessarily the most sort of classically smart kind of people. Um, Surprisingly, I look for profiles that sometimes are similar to mine. So while I wasn't the most amazing or best student at school and I didn't have the most um, amazing grades, I did give myself a lot of experiences. So, you know, even in working in restaurants or in the hospitality industry. Um, any, any opportunity where you get to build on your experience, um, I'd always recommend, I think, not only do you learn a great deal and you learn the sort of thing that you want to do in your life, it also looks amazing when you see me and there's more chance of you getting employed after that.